a person like me, an entrepreneur at that time, so independent, so egoistic, such a proud person, suddenly you become a disabled. Hi, my name is Stephen Chan. I lost my eyesight at the age of 45, 13 years ago, due to glaucoma and diabetic retinopathy. Thank God, since coming out of the dark back in 2009, I formed the Malaysian Glaucoma Society to create awareness about glaucoma. About two years later, we started a non-profit organization called SOS Missions and counsel even more patients with different kind of eye disorders. And then in 2012, I partnered with the Social Enterprise, which manages and operates Dialogue in the Dark International, to bring this experience into Malaysia as a social enterprise. The main problem our social enterprise trying to tackle is the inequalities in terms of education and also employment and economic enabling opportunities for the often left behind marginalized OKU communities. In Malaysia, uh, registered with the welfare department is half a million OKUs in terms of Children, there are about 60,000 of them studying in about 5,500 special and big schools uh, nationwide. Our country has got more than 5 million diabetics. Before push, 40% of our revenue comes from our selling of workshop programs and also education programs and also public tours. 60% we still have to depend on grants and donations. Uh, the biggest challenge for us was always finding the funds to continue our work. Thanks to PUSH, we have engaged additional staff to help us in the project coordination and we have extended our training to another five more uh, visually and mentally impaired uh, youths. Our plan, of course, is to build a resilience team park, bring all the disabled people together and create even more impact so that they can have a place to show their capabilities rather than having public perception that they are disabled. We want this team park to be a place where people can see that these people are actually able. Push is very important. It is a very good initiative by magic. Uh, it's also important uh, that we have this accreditation that a professional body, a government agency is accrediting our works which will help instill more confidence from the public and also the corporates as well.